What's going on you guys? I got the uh, Dell Dimension L800R up and running. I decided yesterday to attempt to install Windows 98 on this machine. And as you see I got video and sound. You can see the um, volume thing down there. And I apologize for the monitor's refresh rate it usually would do. But I've ran into two little problems with drivers. It's basically something to deal with do with the um, dial-up modem and the Ethernet card. And this is the original dial-up modem and Ethernet card out. I tried a different one, but it wouldn't. Li it didn't like it. And plus, installing the um, drivers for the Ethernet card from the with the original one that was in that Dell computer. Windows didn't like it. It kept asking for a Netgear CD for this Netgear FA3010, I mean 31, or actually 310TX REV-2. And it didn't like the um, drivers for the um, Connexent dial-up modem. And this is like a weird dial-up modem I've ever seen with this little black thing on it. But, yeah. So I'm definitely not going to do it. Can't be able to make a video of Windows 98 running on this. But it runs okay, but you couldn't get two drivers installed. And I like to get all my drivers up and working. Just to have th everything working and be on the safe side, you know what I mean? But, uh... So therefore, I'm definitely going back to Windows 2000 on this machine. Because it somehow doesn't like Windows 98. The only thing that Windows 98 don't really like is the drivers that this computer has. In 2000, I actually recognize the drivers and Windows ME, even though I'm not putting Windows ME on this machine. Because as you see, it's already, it has a little sticker that says it's designed for Windows 98 and Windows 2000 and NT 4.0. It, it came originally shipped with a Windows ME COA. So, yeah, I'm definitely going to go ahead and put the, the Ethernet card in this dial-up modem back in this Dell. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead. And it's even trying to pick up a driver for internet connection sharing. So I might as well give that up and uh, and please ignore the um, phone ringing in the background. And I'm going to go ahead and shut it down and put those two cars back in and do another update video and thanks for watching.